What's up guys? Welcome back to another edition of Skate Park Lessons with me, JB, here at the Sunnyvale Skate Park. And today we're going to continue our important lesson about knee slides, but this time it's going to be in transitions. First, we're going to practice on the edge of the coping without our skateboards. And I want you to pick the smallest quarter pipe, stand on the edge of the coping with your toes hanging over, and drop to your knees so your bottom touches your heels. Your goal for this is to land as high as possible in the transition. Next, we're going to start to do this into a bigger transition. Once you get comfortable with the smaller quarter pipe, your goal is going to be to build that confidence because we want this to become a reflex. So you don't even have to think about getting to your knees. If you don't like your trick or you feel sketchy, you can lean in and slide down with as little risk as possible. Now we're into the big bowl here at Sunnyvale. Seven feet high, sit on the coping, hands grab the coping, and notice I'm scooting to the edge. I pull my legs up to a side that feels comfortable and let yourself drop out and drop in onto your knees. Let the ramps do the work and just slide down and relax. After you get comfortable practicing your knee slides from a sitting position on the coping, then it's gonna be your time to do it standing on the coping. When you're learning this, spread your feet out just a little bit, toes over the edge, bend down, and let myself kind of drop out and lean back and slide. So make sure those toes are over the edge and lean your bottom to your heels, leaning back. Let the ramps do the work. Next is the wash. You pick a side to lean to and you let your legs kind of swoop up behind your body. I let myself kind of start to fall to the side. Next, jump straight up, tuck your legs back and into your slide. Now we add to this. Imagine I start back by the fence, I go full speed, I pop my ollie and I want to land floating, floating, floating and I want to land into the ramp right here. You run and jump in. Remember to push off of your last step. Most advanced here at Sunnyvale is gonna be the vert wall. Vert ramps come in all shapes and sizes. The term vert comes from the word vertical. Vertical means straight up and down. Vert ramps are typically 10 feet or over, so it's always a great idea to wear knee pads, elbow pads, and a helmet while skating them. This is definitely too high for me to just jump in. So, I'm gonna wash to the side, try to get my knee pads to touch that vert, or as close to it as possible, spread my feet out, I start to bend down, doesn't matter which side you do. I feel a little more comfortable this way today. Leaning, leaning, leaning. Let myself drop into my slide. Buy good pads made for skating. Protec or 187, 888 makes pretty good pads as well. They will save your body and it's cheaper than the emergency room. I hope you learned a lot of stuff, especially how to take care of your knees. Please subscribe to my channel. Continue to leave comments and support. That way we'll keep making more videos for you. 